Welcome to Mixology Flare. Let me ask you a question. Are you the alpha male in the group and grunt at the gym, but secretly love pink vodka cocktails and listen to Madonna on the weekends? Well, this drink's for you. And don't go anywhere, because at the end of the video, we're gonna announce who won the smoking box giveaway. I know in today's world of mixology, vodka cocktails are not that cool, but there was a time that the Cosmopolitan was ordered every other drink. Everyone wanted to have it. Sex in the City came out, everybody wanted a Cosmo. Now the King Cocktail, Dale DeGraw, credited with inventing the cocktail, but actually there's tons of rumors that Cheryl Cook created the cocktail in South Miami Beach a little bit before Dale. And he even credits Cheryl in his book, Craft of the Cocktail. But actually, in the 50s, 60s, and 70s, Ocean Spray Cranberry Juice published an entire campaign on cocktails made with cranberry juice. And the closest one was the Harpoon, which is basically vodka, lime juice, and cranberry juice. So today, let's create the Cosmopolitan, and I'm gonna create one other cocktail that's just a little twist on the Cosmopolitan that's a little bit more modern. It's got a little spice to it, and I think you'll love it. Ooh, I like this one. In a mixing glass, one ounce of cranberry juice, quarter ounce of lime juice, half ounce of Cointreau orange flavored liqueur, and the recipe actually calls for a citrus vodka, but if you don't have a citrus vodka, regular vodka works just fine. One and a half ounces. Add a little ice. Give it a good hard, good hard shake. Now you don't want a deep red color, just a slight pink color. That's why there's only an ounce of cranberry juice. Now there's two ways that you can garnish this cocktail. If you want some pretty colors, go with a lime wheel. You don't want to go with a lime wedge because this really indicates to the person that's drinking it to squeeze the lime. And you don't want to mess up the balance of this drink, so go with the lime wheel right here on the side. But the actual cocktail recipe from Dale calls for a flame orange peel. Now you don't want to peel like this. This peel is going to be too thin to get a good zest over the cocktail. It's great for cocktails like Old Fashions, but when you're flaming a cocktail, it's much better to use a disc because it's thicker, and when you squeeze the disc, the oils are gonna jump right off the skin. Take a torch or some matches. Lightly warm the outside of the skin. Just get the oils ready. Squeeze it right on top of the flame. Do a little rub. Drop it right in. There's your Cosmo. I mean, come on. It's still a really good cocktail, even though it's pink. I might put it in a bucket glass. So if you were here for our last video, the smoke old fashion, you know that we gave away a smoking box. Here's the winner. All right, now the moment you've all been waiting for, the winner of the smoking box giveaway. Well, I'm joined by my beautiful assistant, Blanca. All right, I have the entries right here in my jacket. Pick your favorite one. Don't, don't look. Don't look. No cheating. Okay, let's pick a good one. The audience is waiting for you. Are you excited? Let's do it. Sherry Hart! Congratulations, Sherry Hart. You just won a smoking box. Make sure to check your DMs. We're going to connect with you, get your address, and send out a smoking box just for you. The Burning Mandarin Cocktail, in my opinion, is the modern version of the Cosmopolitan. It's a cross between the Cosmo and the Lemon Drops, but it's spicy with Serrano chilies, so be careful. Start with your martini glass and just rim the outside with sugar. You don't want to get sugar on the inside of the rim, just the outside. In a mixing glass, quarter ounce of simple syrup. This is where it gets really easy. Half ounce of orange juice, half ounce cranberry juice, quarter ounce of Cointreau, Three quarter ounce lemon juice and one and a half ounces of mandarin vodka. Ice your glass. Now you're gonna need one Serrano. You don't have to pulverize this. Just press it one time. That's all you need. Make sure it's fun tight. 
thing about chilies is you don't want to get it on your fingers or get it near your eyes, and if the tin blows up in your face, I mean, your eyes are going to be hurting. <laughs> Total pink color. There's a little shade of orange. You have one more slice of serrano and that's your garnish. Drop it right in. And that's your burning mandarin. You can definitely see the difference in hue. Pink, little shade of orange, classic Cosmo, the burning mandarin. Yeah, it's got some heat on it. And since I don't drink a lot of vodka, I got a taste tester, special invite. Hi. Cosmopolitan. That's it? Hmm? <laughs> I tasted cranberry juice in it. For sure. Okay. Burning Mandarin, okay. what do you think? Ooh, I like this one. Yes. You choose this one? Yes, I like the spiciness. I can drink on a different part, well, because you have cooties and I don't want to drink what you did. <laughs> yeah, that, that's good. Way better. All right, you take this one. Okay. I'll take this one. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Let me know in the comments which one you made and which one you like better. Cheers and congratulations. Thanks for hanging out. Here's our next video. Go click on that. We'll see you soon.